Froggy, where's play date? It was Saturday. Froggy woke up and yelled, Hooray! It's Saturday. I want to go out and play. Froggy hopped out of bed and got dressed. Zip, zoop, zup, zut, 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 zat. Then he flopped to the kitchen for something to eat. Flop, flop, flop. He looked in the fridge. Slam. He looked in the cabinet. Slam. He looked in the cookie jar. Aha! Uh -huh. And he ate a chocolate fly cookie. Munch, crunch, munch. Froggy! called his mother. What? Go back to sleep, dear. It's Saturday. No school today. I don't want to go back to sleep, cried Froggy. I want to go out and play. So Froggy flopped over to Max's house. Flop, flop, flop. Max! Come out and play, he hollered. But Max wasn't home. He'd gone to visit his grandma. He flopped over to Matthew's house. Flop, flop, flop. Matthew, come out and play. But Matthew wasn't home either. He'd gone to play golf with his dad. So he flopped over to Travis's house. Flop, flop, flop. Travis, come out and play. But Travis wasn't home either. He'd gone to his tuba lesson. Froggy dragged himself home. Schlump, schlump, schlump. Mom, cried Froggy, nobody's home. That's okay, dear, she said. I made a play date for you with Froggy Lena. No way, cried Froggy. Yes way, said Mom. Dad's taking you to the movies to see the Frog Prince. I'm not going, cried Froggy, and he went to his room and slammed the door. Blam! He plopped onto the bed and blew his saxophone. Honk! Screech! Squawk! Froggy! yelled Dad. What? Stop that racket! He blew once more. Bleep! Then he pulled on his baseball glove and threw the ball against the wall. Thump, thump, thump. Froggy, yelled Dad. What? I told you to stop that racket. Now! Froggy threw down his glove. He wanted to go out and play, but nobody was home. And he did want to see the frog prince, even if Froggyolina had to come along. So he hopped up and put on his favorite bow tie, snap, and looked at himself in the mirror. Hey, good looking, he said, and winked. Froggy, called Dad. What? Let's go. It's time for your play date. Wait, said Froggy, and he raced to the bathroom and slapped on his dad's aftershave. Splat, splat, splat. Yikes, he yelled. My face is on fire. When they got to Froggyolina's, she sniffed the air. Sniff, sniff, sniff. Pew, she said. What's that funny smell? What smell, said Froggy. I don't smell anything. And he hid behind his dad's back. When they got to the movies, Froggy sat with dad in the dark. Froggy Lena scooted next to Froggy. Froggy moved to the other side of his dad, but Froggy Lena moved next to him again. Go away, cried Froggy. Quiet, said Dad. The movie's starting. It was hard to sit still. Froggy tossed popcorn up and tried to catch it in his mouth, but some landed on Froggy Lena's head instead. She threw a whole handful back. Popcorn fight, cried Froggy. Soon, there was a blizzard of popcorn. Zwit, zwit, zwit. Stop it, cried Dad. Sit still and watch the movie. But I have to go to the bathroom, cried Froggy. And Dad, I had to go with him. By the time they got back, Froggy Lena was watching her favorite part. When the princess kisses the frog. So what do you think she did? She gave Froggy a big smooch, smack on the cheek. 
Ew! cried Froggy, looking more red in the face than green. This is the worst play date ever! On the way home from the movie, Froggy's dad got them ice cream cones at Screamin' Mimi's. Froggy licked his slurp and said, Wanna taste mine? Froggy Lena batted her eyelashes and said, You're a real prince, Froggy. And she bit off the bottom half of his cone, crunch, and handed it back. So ice cream dripped on Froggy's lap. All the way home, drip, drip, drip. It was the worst play date ever. Thank you for watching this video. Please subscribe to our channel so you won't miss any fresh videos. I created a drink in your. The end. The rest is medicated.